Yo, how's it going? Yet again, another unboxing video um, from FB Sale. You know, you know the hashtag. This one is from Triple Melonade, aka Moro, Moro Bernard. It's just a homie for letting me buy this off of him. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it and show you what uh, what I got. I usually get envelopes from people whenever I buy stuff. He actually sent a box. So I think there might be a few more things in here. I'm pretty excited about it, so let's hop right into this. Um, I have a shit ton of knives, but I always forget to have them ready. And then I start filming, and then I just want to keep going. So got my good old keys. We'll do the job just the same. I think that the box is a better idea. As you know, some of you may know, my 22 at the you know, call up thing broke in the way here and that was unfortunate. And that was just bad handling from the postal service. It is what it is. I ended up setting up the board and I super glued it like on the crack. I kinda like just stretched that crack open and then smear some wood glue in there and then I like let it go back to normal and then it dried overnight pretty good. So it feels pretty solid like I don't know. I haven't really seshed this one yet. I've been going at my funeral and I just barely changed the grip on this one so I'm gonna keep session this one for the next um for the next week yeah till I get my new uh, level edges stacks anyways okay I managed to open the box and I see some bubble wrap right on top okay oh, oh no oh shit Mora what is this dude Hey, okay, look. This <laughs> homie. Dude, I love candy, man. Thank you so much. Hell yeah, Warhead. This thing's probably busting. Oh shit. <laughs> a Warhead uh, sucker. Popsicle. Dope. Thank you. Oh, that's gonna be yummy, man. Dude, he gave me a bunch of stuff. Bruh. More Warheads, dude. Dude, Morrow. Thanks, man. Shit. Oh god. Just gonna do that. Okay, so this was at the very bottom. The box is empty now. I'm gonna put that on the side. Put this bubble wrap back in the box. The deck's right here. But I wanna show you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. So he shit. He sent me a lot of candy. Like I'm showing one by one, but not nah, fuck that. Okay, so all of these. And a bunch of suckers. And a bunch of little stickers, man. Holy. Do you guys want me to show you, you know, the stickers? Uh, I usually do. It's, a, it's quite a few, so it might take a while. But hopefully, this is what um, you'd like to see also, you know? Oof. Okay. We got one of these. I've had uh, one of these before a long time ago. No, no. About last year. Uh, but I remember I used them all up. But cool. The re-up, it's here. From the plug moral <laughs> thanks man okay got that Ooh, this is cool that's the dude from the shining right and then i don't know who that is looks familiar though looks like a, looks like it's a good movie what's up g yeah you can play your music man fuck yeah this is i can tell this hand this is chris Petronek's hand Okay, this is the Snake House One Million Knife Lord uh, owner, and dude, it's funny because I heard of Chris when I did. I had no idea he fingerboarded at all, but I started watching like before I got back into fingerboarding. I was uh, skating a lot and watching skate videos very constant, and I came across the Wild Grape series like video parts, and Chris Petronek has a part for Wild Grapes and. That's how I heard of Chris before I even knew he fingerboarded. it. So, shout outs to Chris, like I've known of this guy forever. Cool guy. I haven't met him, but he's a cool guy. Okay. Hell yeah, finger space go. 10% off coupon, definitely cool. Ooh, I've never had catfish stuff before. Catfish barbecue. Oh, what the hell is this, man? This is cool. Fresh off the grill. I'm sorry about my ignorance. I guess a deck comes in here, but it's just like, the content dude, is super cool. I've never had anything catfish barbecue in my life before. And this is very dope. 
Thank you, man. Okay, we got a real duck deck sticker. Thank you. Another finger space go podcast. Radical finger words. Oh my god. Dude, literally like who else sent me? Internet only also sent me this, I believe. Yeah, he sent me this to a stickers with his F deck. A matter of fact, I have the stickers right here. I forgot to put them away. <laughs> fucking fucking awesome, awesome. That works for me. Thank you. And a flat face. Good old Mike Schneider. I. This is where the stickers came in. Okay, now we are gonna hop onto the deck. Um. Dude, this unboxing is massive. Like, I got so much free stuff, like a bunch of candy worth of stuff. Anyways, got a bunch of shit. And thank you, Moro. We're gonna go ahead and um, untape this bad boy and look what we got. Okay, this is just the deck. It comes with tape already. And. Holy fudge. Look at this. Berling wood. It's so beautiful. 29 millimeter. It's literally brand new. I do recall that he had set it up. He only used like two holes on each base plate. You know, he uh, other fingerboards do that. Um, I have very old base plates, so I have to use all four holes because then they wouldn't stay on very good. So, but if I break in brand new BRTs, I'll probably just do holes so that I make mine last, you know, longevity type deal. And uh, yeah, um, immaculate. There's a little chip on the on the uh, on the graphic there from maybe a pop or two, but the thing is just I bought Berlin was like with a graphic less, you know, clean like that. This this is very clean. Look at the shape. Good old Berlin with shape. Everyone loves and knows. I'm, I'm stuck man yeah and I probably won't set this up I'm sorry if you think I'm a f um, and the graphic wears down okay so I, I, some people like to know this but um, my thing is that I like Berlin woods that uh, have uh, dyed plies underneath the graphic like a uh, natural wood color it's it's all right like I like to see some some bright you know some colorful stuff so on this one I asked them so what what pl what ply do we have underneath the graphic and he told me we have a, like a purple burgundy type deal I was like okay sign me up take my money it's very beautiful I don't know how I'm gonna try to get close oh my god this is such a bad lens <laughs> damn it's fine it's fine hope that's good enough uh, yeah, it's like a burgundy. I will take the tape off, but it's brand new. I think I'm just gonna keep it with the tape on there, man. Not, not really to worry about it. That collection's growing. I don't know how big. I, I'm trying to. I mean, eventually people are gonna run out of their Berlin woods because I'm gonna have them all. If if that's the case, different people collect different brands. You know, people. Some people collect Flint. Some people collect Berlin woods. Uh, whatever. People collect different stuff. I've been into Berlin woods and I love it. It's a good. I feel like it's a good collection to have because I grew up. I just simply grew up wanting this stuff, and and now that I'm uh, where I'm at, I like to treat myself and just. I feel like I just keep wanting to get it. It feels like it feels like back in the day when I wanted this so bad, and now that I feel every time I know that my Berlin wood is in the mail, I get so so excited. It's like I'm a little kid in Christmas, man. All right, but enough uh, talking. I'm gonna. Mark is playing his music very loud now. He wasn't kidding, but that's okay. I don't mind it. I just don't want to make the video hard uh, for people to listen to. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you what we got. Just like this, like super messy, whatever. Thank you so much, Moro. This thing is badass. All of it, everything. I'm super happy about. I am super happy. It's like Halloween came early, you know. And of course up it all off we got the burling wood i bought this burling wood and this is extras all of it is extras fuck yeah thank you for watching i will see you in another video peace out